Hello guys and welcome to the channel. This is going to be a bit of a quick video this today. It's going to be a bit gorilla style as well, should we say. I won't plan on doing this, but one of my grails, or my grail, has just come. Now, I've been waiting for this since I ordered it, I think November time. And I've been waiting, it was, when was it? It was scheduled May, then it got delayed, and it was scheduled June, end of June. And it got close to end of June, I thought, here it's going to come, it's going to come, it's going to come. And then it got delayed again till like September, October time. I had three figures this year that I really wanted to pick up. The Kingpin Marvel Legends bath, which I've got, and is awesome, that lived up to my expectations. The John Wick Chapter 2 Math X figure, again, that lived up to my expectations. But, most of all, this was number one on the list. So out of them three figures, this was number one. So I just want to do a quick unboxing video of that. And then there'll be a review coming soon. But I thought I'd do a quick unboxing of it now. So let's try and find a good place for this camera. So the camera is in a good place and you can see good. Now I've not seen one of these in the wild. This is the first time I'm going to see one in person. Uh, I am a bit worried because as you can see the box is a bit of a mess. I thought it'd come in a lot bigger box. I've ordered a lot more smaller figures and they're coming bigger boxes, so I am a bit worried about the packaging on this. Uh, the figure is from Comics and Cocktails, which are uh, usually good and I pre order all the time from. Uh, a great price as well, I think it was £60. But I want to be careful here. Oh, I've got a feeling this is going to be damaged. I really don't want to damage this. Like I said, this is my number one figure. I've been waiting for. Sorry about my desk, because all my desks are here. Crafted. Uh, right. So I have just covered my details. Can you know, you guess where it is? So let's have a look. And as you can probably take out, or mech out, should I say, where it is. You can see that. It is the Mezco 112 Collective Netflix Punisher. So, glad they have packaged it all around. Mm, can't see any damage as of yet. I'll point to my arm just before as well, so you can make out this Punisher skull there. Skull there. I didn't know if you got that, but... So, uh, Where's me? You really want to be careful. Now, I have got the other Mezco Punisher. The, uh, I think it's just the standard one. And I've not actually reviewed it yet. I've not actually opened it up. So that review will be coming pretty soon too. But... I love the box, these Mezco, and I've been waiting for so long for this. John Burnfall's Punisher is my ideal Punisher. I absolutely love him. I am going to meet him, I think, in December, I think it is, in Manchester. Oh, and it's in the bag. So, the box seems in good. It's brightly light. Box seems in good condition, so I think we might have got luck here. No, there's a bit of a couple of marks, but that's standard. Yeah, I think we've got luck. Let's have a look. So, just a bit of tape up here. Let's look open. I'm not opening up the figure yet, I'm just doing an unboxing. We'll have a quick look inside. Oh, God. So there's a protective cover over it. Oh, that's pretty good. Cool. So, here we go. As you can see the shiny cover and the box is in pretty good. Let me move this bubble wrap. The box is in pretty good shape. Quite happy at that. So let's slide this off a sec. Pause, play and display. There you have it. There's the figure. Now 
the back you can see everything you get with him so you get the two handguns you get the knife you get the minigun you get the stand you get all the extra arms the extra head sculpt oh i cannot wait to see this guy so let's have a look at him Oh, so you can actually see him. Let's go upwards. Slide it upwards. There we go. Oh my god. So the warhouse left some protective sheen again as well. And there he is. I'm up camera in a minute so you can get a better look without light. And then we've got the, what's he called now? Gomez. Gomez Golo go, Gomez. Oh wow. Oh, I cannot wait to get in this. Uh, I've got my Friday 13th review to do. And then I've got this bad boy. With his leather jacket. Somewhere. But this is my number one figure I've been waiting for. Like I said, the other two I've lived up. Hopefully this does. I'm not opening it yet, like I said, this is just an unboxing. But it's positive. I was really worried with box. But it is actually in really good shape. So I am going to display it with the other one. So, as you can see, I have the other 112 Punisher. And this box is actually a bit thicker. It's not as tall, it's a bit thicker. Uh, I got this one brand new... When they first came out, I think it was £50. Let's have a quick look. As you can see, it's the comic version. There's a lot of fakes around of these, but this one is real. I've had it since it came out. Check out that bad boy. I love the artwork on the inside. So this guy is going to get reviewed as well at some point. I want to mix accessories up as well, to be honest. But the review of this guy coming as well. I have just noticed there's a bit of a dint there. It's not too bad though. So guys, as you can see, I've got a lot of unboxing to do and a lot of reviews to come. We've even got some loose figures under there as well, as you can see. So all this stuff is gonna get unboxed and reviewed. So guys, as you can see, I've got a lot of stuff coming up. Hit that subscribe button, like and comment below and all that good stuff. Check out my Instagram and Twitter. I've got loads of stuff planned and I will see you in the next one. Cheers, guys. Bye.